Introduction, welcome to the captivating world of One Life to Live, a groundbreaking television series that first graced the screens in 1968. This iconic soap opera quickly became a beloved staple of daytime television, captivating audiences for decades with its riveting storytelling and memorable characters. Throughout its illustrious run, One Life to Live captured the hearts of viewers across the nation, leaving an indelible mark on the history of television. Why One Life to Live is so popular, one of the primary reasons for the enduring popularity of One Life to Live lies in its ability to delve into the lives of its characters, skillfully portraying their trials, tribulations, and triumphs. The show's creators crafted a rich tapestry of interconnected storylines, blending romance, drama, mystery, and suspense. Audiences were drawn to the relatable characters, who faced a myriad of challenges that mirrored real-life struggles. Moreover, One Life to Live was renowned for tackling social issues, often reflecting the changing times and sensitively addressing subjects like race, class, and family dynamics. This fearless approach to storytelling not only resonated with viewers, but also earned the show critical acclaim and numerous awards. Notable actors and actresses, over the years, One Life to Live boasted an impressive roster of talented actors and actresses who brought their characters to life with remarkable depth and authenticity. One of the show's most iconic stars was Erica Slezak, who portrayed the venerable Victoria Lord Buchanan. Her portrayal of Vicky earned her an unprecedented six daytime Emmy Awards for Outstanding Lead Actress, making her one of the most decorated soap opera actors of all time. Other notable actors who graced the series with their talents included Robin Strasser as the formidable Dorian Lord, Robert S. Woods as the steadfast Beau Buchanan, and Judith Light as the complex Karen Wolick. These and many other actors contributed to the show's magnetic appeal, ensuring that viewers remained engrossed in the unfolding drama day after day. Fond memories, as we take a nostalgic trip down memory lane with one life to live, we invite you, the viewer, to share your fondest memories of the show. Perhaps you remember sitting around the television with loved ones, engrossed in the latest dramatic twists and turns. Or maybe a particular storyline touched your heart and stayed with you throughout the years. Whether it's the unforgettable performances, the compelling story arcs, or the emotional connections forged with the characters, One Life to Live undoubtedly holds a special place in the hearts of its dedicated audience. In conclusion, One Life to Live remains an extraordinary television series that stands as a testament to the power of storytelling and the indomitable spirit of its viewers. Its enduring popularity and cultural impact continue to be felt long after its final episode aired. So, we ask you, dear viewer, to share your treasured memories of this beloved show and celebrate the enduring legacy it has left behind. Step back to the golden era of television with One Life to Live, a beloved soap opera that debuted in 1968. The show's defining moment came in 1988 with the creation of the awe-inspiring Great Hall of Eterna. This architectural wonder, the largest set ever built for a daytime drama, transported viewers to a realm of grandeur and mystique. Crafted with meticulous attention to detail, the Great Hall became a character itself, adding depth to the narrative. Despite its magnificence, the set presented challenges and demanded dedicated coordination from the production crew. It became a stage for climactic and emotional scenes, leaving an enduring impact on the show's legacy. As time passed, one life to live in its iconic Great Hall of Eterna became unforgettable in television history. It continues to inspire filmmakers to push boundaries in production design, proving that true artistry knows no limits, even in daytime drama. Let's raise a toast to the timeless allure of the Great Hall, a masterpiece born from the magic of storytelling. May its splendor live on, captivating new audiences and reigniting the passion of those who once gathered around their screens to witness the enthralling saga of one life to live. And so, dear reader, as we bid farewell to this captivating tale of ambition and artistry, we leave you with the closing words. Step back in time to the magical world of one life to live, the iconic TV series captivating hearts since 1968. Follow the Buchanan family's emotional roller coaster, rivaled only by the grandest soap opera sagas. Amidst the unforgettable characters, Nathan Fillion Sean is the charming Joey Buchanan, endearing himself to fans worldwide. His dedication brought depth and authenticity to the character, 
leaving a lasting impact. Joey's journey was filled with trials, love, heartbreak, victories, and defeats. Nathan Fillion's performance made viewers laugh, cry, and cheer as he navigated life in Linview. The show explored intricate relationships, from love triangles to family feuds, delving into human emotions and resilience. Over the years, One Life to Live fearlessly addressed social issues like racial inequality and LGBTQ plus rights, fostering essential discussions. It became an integral part of people's lives, leaving a profound void when it was canceled in 2012 after four decades on air. However, the legacy lives on as fans still cherish the storytelling magic. Nathan Fillion's portrayal of Joey Buchanan remains a symbol of the show's brilliance, reminding us of the impact of great television. In conclusion, One Life to Live was more than a series. It was an emotional journey through life's highs and lows, brought to life by talented actors like Nathan Fillion. Its ability to resonate with viewers and tackle societal issues solidified its place in TV history. The memories and emotions stirred are its cherished legacy, a captivating tale. In television history, certain shows leave indelible marks on viewers, transcending time. One Life to Live was such a masterpiece. Originally titled Between Heaven and Hell, it debuted in 1968, altering daytime drama with its captivating storylines. The show explored the human experience, delving into emotions and controversial themes of love, betrayal, and social inequality. The exceptional writing struck a balance between authenticity and drama, keeping audiences engaged. Its ensemble cast brought characters like Victoria Lord and Roger Todd Manning to life. Beyond enthralling viewers, it became a cultural touchstone, forming a devoted community. Over time, One Life to Live stayed relevant by tackling contemporary issues. However, all good things end, and the show bid farewell, leaving a lasting legacy. One Life to Live wasn't just a TV series, it mirrored the intricacies of the human condition, a testament to storytelling's power. Its impact endures in television history, inspiring new generations of storytellers. Once upon a time, in the world of television drama, two iconic soap operas thrived. One Life to Live in General Hospital. Initially half-hour shows, NBC and CBS expanded their rival soaps to an hour to compete. ABC, however, took a unique approach by extending both shows to 45 minutes, hoping to retain viewers and save costs. Unfortunately, the plan backfired, and viewers switched to fully hour-long rival soaps. Realizing their mistake, ABC eventually conceded and extended both shows to an hour within a year. Despite the setback, One Life to Live and General Hospital continued to captivate audiences with love, drama, intrigue, and heartache. The soap opera genre proved resilient, thanks to the dedication of devoted fans. This tale reminds us that television demands constant adaptation and learning from mistakes. As the industry evolves, so must the shows that grace our screens, ensuring they captivate audiences for generations to come. The story of these two iconic soap operas serves as a captivating reminder of their mark on television history.